In this video, we take a look at the progress of the Cockcrow Living Heathland Bridge, the UK's first of its kind. Starting alongside Ockham Bites, we follow the path of the new Bridal Way, which will lead up and over the completed bridge. When open in late 2025 it will link Ockham Common to the right, with Whistley Common for the first time since the A3 was built. In this view, we are looking northwesterly towards Whistley Common from the edge of Ockham Common. Once planted, the bridge will be mainly heathland, with a bridleway, and access for Surrey Wildlife Trust vehicles. We now fly in a westerly direction, over the bridge, from Ockham Common, bottom, towards Whistley Common at the top. The bridge deck is completed, with the main work now being done to complete the embankments. We are now facing southeast, looking at Ockham Common at the top. Ockham Bites comes into view, in the top right, which will become the central food and parking place for the new walks, when these open by late 2025. We are now flying east, over the bridge, from Whistley to Ockham Common. You can see the area cleared of non-native trees, to allow the natural heathland to re-establish. Looking straight down on the bridge, we are flying back from Ockham, to Whistley Common. You can see the space left to allow for the widening of the A3 in both directions. Facing the M25 Junction 10 and the northbound A3, we now fly the first quadrant around the new bridge. We end facing northwesterly over Whistley Common. In the next quadrant, we start facing southwest over the bridge and the southbound A3. We end facing southeasterly, looking over Ockham Common. Thank you for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please click the like button and consider subscribing to the channel.